Hey guys, today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how I did this half crown braid. So to start off you'll want to have your hair parted to the side and then you're just going to start on the larger half of your hair doing a regular three strand Dutch braid. So that's just crossing each piece underneath one another. And you're going to want to grab hair from either side to start and then you're only going to start grabbing hair from the back. So once you reach about the top of your temple, you're only going to be Dutch braiding in hair from the top and then leaving out the hair from the bottom. So this part can be a little bit tricky just because I need to rearrange my hands to continue braiding from the back of my head. So what I do is I drop the bottom piece and then I'll grab with my left hand the top and the middle section and then hold the bottom part with my right hand and continue braiding it. So like I said, it can be a little bit tricky, but once you figure it out, it's so much easier to braid in this position for the back of your head. So now you'll just continue around back doing a regular Dutch braid, only pulling in hair from the top and not the bottom. So now I'm at the point again where I need to rearrange my hands to continue braiding up the top half. I found this side so much trickier than the last side to rearrange, but once you figure it out, you'll just continue the last section of your Dutch braid up the top of your head. Once you're finished Dutch braiding, you're just going to finish off with a regular braid with the leftover hair. So once you've secured your braid with a hair elastic, you're just going to pin it in place and try and hide the elastic and the bobby pin under the first half of the braid so it looks like it's a nice continuous braid around the crown of your head. So I'm going to leave this as a skinnier braid just because I like that look for this style but you're more than welcome to pull it out if you want it to look a little bit bigger. And that's pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and I will see you again next time.